everyone welcome back to my channel um, it's 5 a.m. in the morning right now we are about to do a briefing so let me get back to you <laughs> I'm working with the beautiful Daphne Ooh, this queen queen bee over here she's always camera ready <laughs> <laughs> We're working on the 321. I'm the number three. Daphne will be my number two. We have a great crew. We have a great crew, so we're gonna have a great time. Um, yeah, let me see. I'm the number three, so I have to do all the checks in the middle of the cabin. That's my jump seat over there for takeoff and landing. And two hours and 39 minutes to go to Fort Lauderdale. And then uh, we're gonna be um, switching planes and we're gonna be dead heading to San Juan so we do have a really easy day today just finished my checks um, yeah we're gonna have a full flight it's currently 5 a.m. in the morning <laughs> so I've been up from 3 a.m. then I snoozed for like 15 minutes <laughs> and now I am here <laughs> But yeah, like I said, we're gonna have um, an easy day. So I don't have, I really can't complain. I really can't complain um, for being up so early because we just worked one flight. And that's about it. We're getting ready to board up right now and start our day. Oh. Daphne is reminding me to video vlog. <laughs> Because <laughs> I keep forgetting to update you guys. <laughs> We're in Fort Lauderdale and um, that was a really easy flight. The good thing about waking up early and doing an early flight is that... <laughs> and a lot of people are sleeping. So yeah, so that was a really easy flight for us. We have a two hour sit and then we get to deadhead. Bye! <laughs> we just boarded. Um, you're probably wondering why I have regular clothes on is because we're deadheading and um, for those of you that don't know deadheading is like a flight attendant's favorite thing oh that's my boo yeah. <laughs> um, so we get to sit in a regular customer seat and we um, we still get paid like regular working flight attendants ah. <laughs> right Daphne we're never mad about a dead head. Never. never mad about a dead head. So she's gonna go to sleep. You can watch a movie. You can do whatever you want because we get to sit down and relax. And um, we're gonna head to Puerto Rico. And then um, <laughs> that's my boo over there. He lives in Puerto Rico. He's not gonna hang out with us. He's gonna go home and be boring. Um, <laughs> Uh, yeah, so we're gonna go to Puerto Rico and yeah, and my friend Courtney's over there, so you get a chance to meet her once we get there. All right, that's all I got for you now. I'm tuning out, I'm gonna go be a regular customer. but there's really not much to look at it's kind of a little basic there's not even any view there's yeah there's really like nothing um but i'm gonna change real quick and then um i'm gonna go meet courtney and we're probably gonna go get some food and just hang out so i was able to get three little naps in on the plane for my dead head um, unfortunately, I was sitting in row 10, and that's the row that doesn't recline. So every time I dozed off, I just kept waking up a little. But um, it's okay. I feel a little refreshed. 
And then um, as long as I get some food in me, I should be a little more awake. <laughs> But yeah, now you know what deadheading is about. Um, I always prefer to deadhead with regular clothes on rather than my uniform. It's just more comfortable to sit in a customer seat and just relax more. Um, so yeah, tomorrow we have a really early report. It's, five, it's at 5 a.m. So we gotta make sure we go to bed early. <laughs> This is Courtney, my baby. We're in San Juan. <laughs> we're, on, we're in old San Juan right now. We're gonna go get some food and some drinks and uh, we'll see where the night takes us. Cause it's gonna be an early night because you know, we have an early report time. Can't tell them what time. <laughs> I already did, so whatever. It's fine. We are gonna be very responsible. <laughs> We're gonna get our one from the phone The shrimp of phone Stephanie has fired me from, from vlogging yes, my stuff exactly. because I'm not. She's missing too much. She is missing too much. She doesn't listen to the director. <laughs> I am the director. <laughs> I can't keep up. <laughs> um, we're, <laughs> we are in JFK right now. Um, we had a two hour sit that turned into a three plus. We don't know how long. Because <laughs> we... Um, <laughs> Because, um, oh, our, our first officer felt sick, so now we're waiting for a new first officer. Um, so we just hang out on the plane. We flew in from Puerto Rico to JFK this morning, super early. Um, I regret it. I regret every decision I made last night from hanging out. But... I love you, Courtney, so yes. Um, I don't regret that part. <laughs> what are we doing here? From Bloggers Unite. <laughs> hi. I heard you say hi to Courtney. Hey, Courtney, what up, cuz? <laughs> so, she's recording me as I'm recording. This is, you know what I mean? I'm trying. I'm trying my best over here. <laughs> um, yeah. And then we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna fly to Santo Domingo today, and we're gonna have a layover. And we're not staying up late. <laughs> I know I'm not staying up late. Um, <laughs> Daphne already said she's not hanging out with us. <laughs> yeah. So now we since we have a little sit, I'm gonna go take a nap.
two is complete um we got really lucky because we we ended up not getting delayed even though we had to switch out um our first officer they were able to find somebody really quickly and um yeah and we were able to leave on time so it's four o'clock right now 4 p.m our layover is a little short. It's only like 13 hours. We have another 5 a.m. report tomorrow. 5.20 a.m. report tomorrow morning. So, and tomorrow is just one flight back to New York City. Um, yeah. I can't wait to get some extra sleep today. Because I was sleep deprived yesterday. So, I'm looking forward to that. But before I do that, um... I'm gonna probably go get some sun as much as I can, maybe an hour or two, lay out by the pool and then um, get some food and then I'll call it a night. <laughs> Okay, so you guys are probably going to laugh at me, but I get cold all the time. Like, I guess that's part of the reason why I don't like to live in New York City most of the time. But, um, except when it's summertime. But I'm in a hoodie right now in the Dominican Republic and I'm freezing and my hands are cold and my feet too. And I was trying to like warm up um, the temperature, but it doesn't go any higher like it really doesn't so uh, that's the one thing about these places like where there's like warm climates i feel like they don't they don't put the heat on so daphne taught me how to do this because today we were talking about um working on the plane and being cold and she told me to blow dry my sheets and it works okay <laughs> it works like this is what i was doing earlier so i took the blow dryer and then you hop on it Oh, this feels amazing. <laughs> it works, guys. Um, I'm really happy right now. <laughs>
bright and early. Um, we're back on the regular Airbus 320. I forgot what this thing looked like. <laughs> it's the old plane. Yeah, we've been flying on the new ones and the reconfigured ones, so it feels weird to be back on the airplane, on the old airplane. Um, so three hours and 30 minutes and we'll be home. Home sweet home. Uh, this has been an awesome trip. It was pretty easy. I think we get in early like before nine o'clock. So we should be getting in by nine, right? Yeah. So yeah, so we get the rest of the day off. All right, we're ready to board. And this concludes our vlog, right, Daphne? <laughs> our three-day trip is over. Huh? And now I'm having separation anxiety from all these three beautiful people. Sean's over there. <laughs> He's hiding. <laughs> It's like 25 degrees in New York City. We went from 85 to 25 degrees weather. Oh, I get to have the weekend off. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It's Friday right now, but it's early. It's like 9.30 in the morning, so I get to have the rest of the day off. And the weekend, and then I'll be back in Florida Monday. Um, that concludes the three-day trip. Until next time, guys.